Hey, welcome back to another mod review, everyone. This episode, we will be reviewing my favorite Terraria mod, the Thoria mod. Let's hop into the description. The mod contains 1,600 new items, 54 new armor sets, 110 new enemies, 98 new blocks and furniture, 11 new town NPCs, 10 new bosses, a new biome, and two new classes. So the first con I have with Thorium is with the new classes and their progression. Now obviously it's hard to create an entirely new class from the ground up, especially two of them, but both of them on release were not playable from the beginning to the end. But I can understand releasing the new classes and letting people play with it so they can give feedback, but at the same time I feel like the mod should have just completed the entirety of both classes before releasing it to the public. And if they needed some sort of feedback, they could have just gotten like a handful of beta testers to do so. The next con I have with the mod is the lack of post Moonlord bosses and enemies. Now hear me out on this one. I know Ragnarok is supposed to be the final boss of Thorium, but it seems a little redundant to reward players with some amazing armor and weapon upgrades if you have nothing to use them on. Now people can see these weapons and armor as a reward, but like come on, you go through the entire game upgrading your armor and weapons to progress and fight tougher bosses. So what's the point of doing the aforementioned if there's nothing to use that new equipment on? But you never know, maybe Diver Man Sam has something in the works for more post moon lore content. Alright, now that all of that is said and done, let's hop into the pros. Hmm, where should I start when it comes to a mod like this? You know what, fuck it, let's start with the bosses. Thorium made me fall in love with its boss fights and their sprites. Everything about them is beautifully made. The sprites are sexy, the fights are unique and challenging, all the bosses feel like it's a part of Terraria. Same thing with the weapons and enemies. The enemies from Thorium are pleasant to look at, mini bosses included. And the weapons? Some of the best and unique feeling weapons in any Terraria mod out. I have two more things that I want to say here. I really like the sub weapon class accessories, aka the flail cores and the spear tips. And I also really, really love the two new classes Thorium adds. They're just plain and simple, they're awesome. You gotta go play the mod if you haven't. So, this is the part of the mod review where I say some sentimental shit about the mod and its development crew. I mean, what can I say? Diver Man Sam and whoever else helped them out on the mod did a great job in creating a mod that feels like it's a part of Terraria's vanilla game. I don't know if that was what they were going for, but they did do a good job if they were. I would also like to shout out Fury Forge and Baum for doing some voiceovers for me. Go check them out, I'll have their channels in the description. But it seems like my time is up. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like it and share it with your friends. I want you guys to spread this shit like it's the Black Plague.